Hi, I'm Dedi Zadaguri. We're going to start uh, doing lesson number two, which is drawing number two from the engineering drawing folder. So we're going to start from the top plane here. I want to move this to the next screen. Top plane. And I'm going to start sketching. I'm going to draw, let's say, corner rectangle. And then I'm going to draw a circle. And then I'm going to draw a center line to center the circle. So I'm going to select here and here. Make sure this one is horizontal. I'm going to make this and this to be coincident. Okay. And I'm going to smart dimension the box. Uh, I'm going to start with the longest one. This is 70. And then I'm going to select this one to be 50. And I'm going to select this one to be 40. And then I'm going to draw, well, I'm going to dimension this to be 20. And I'm going to draw a line okay. from here to here to here to here. So this one I can extend it, extend entities over here. Okay, now I'm gonna smart dimension from here to this line right here. This is 30. And then from here to this line right here, this is 20. And then I'm gonna snap this to be coincident with this. I'm going to hold down the control key, select this line and this line, I'm going to set them to be equal. And then I'm going to smart dimension the distance from here to here to be 20. Okay, let's put it over here. And I'm going to set, uh, I'm going to hold down the control key, select this line and this line. I'm going to select them to be collinear. Okay. So I have everything set up here, everything is fully defined. I have all the uh, dimensions I need. And I'm going to use the fillet uh, as a feature here. You can also do it as a, let's say this one I'm going to show you. Sketch fillet and then radius 10. You can just select the point here and point here. Hit OK. And then I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go to my feature, extrude it. I'm gonna select the first contour. This is 20. Again, I just need to click my triangle to show my sketch. I'm gonna highlight my sketch and extrude it again. I'm gonna select the other contour. I'm gonna select this, this contour and this contour. Okay. So this is 40. And I'm going to hit OK. Almost done. I'm going to click this and isometric view. Now, I am just need to cut this one right here by 20. So uh, I can use chamfer. Or I can also select this uh, surface and then sketch it. There's a lot of ways to do it. You can do this if you want to. And then uh, you can smart dimension this to be 20. Okay. And then what I'm going to do, I'm going to extrude cut it. Instead of line up to next. And I can hit OK. And I'm done with my uh, model. Again, go to evolution tab, go to mesh properties, so you can get the, the mesh properties from here. Okay, thank you.